I'm Dr. Maloney, LAPD. Do you know our Judge Joseph Rudisill? I just thought he was trying to be nice. You know, concerned, calling me at work. Did I need anything? Could he do anything for Shelby? He loaned me money. I know I shouldn't have taken it, but with Mike away and daycare and all the other expenses I was having to carry alone, it was really hard to turn down. It's understandable. After all, he was a judge. Maybe he could help you with your husband, get him out earlier. So you believed him? When I realized what he was doing, I, I stopped letting him come over. That's when he and Mike moved upstate. Jill, he hasn't seen her father in almost six months. Christine, you're not alone. There are other women who are victims of this man. If you were willing to make a statement, to testify, if you were to stand together, you might be able to put a stop to this man for everyone. And I know it won't be easy. This is Christine Mannix and her daughter, Shelby. She'd like to speak with you. May we come in? Sure. Okay, you can put her down. Here up. My husband was in a robbery and he was found guilty and sentenced to two and a half years. Judge Rudisill has been using his release. You are in violation of a court order, Dr. Maloney. Am I? Charge me, then. Arrest me. I want this courtroom cleared. I want these people out of here. Bailiff! Do we have you? I have a warrant, Judge. I don't give a damn about your warrant. I sign warrants. Not anymore, you don't. You're through, Rudisell. Watch yourself, Dr. Maloney. You are in a court of law. You will address me as your honor. Honor. Honor? What the hell do you have to do with honor? Hmm? Come down here, you son of a bitch. Let him go. I don't want you up there. I don't want to have to look up to you. Nick, let I don't him want go. you wearing these robes. You're a disgrace. You're out of your league, Maloney. You're in way over your head. Maybe. But I'm not the one you have to worry about. These two women, your victims, they've had enough. They're going to put a stop to you. Who's going to believe them? I am. Lieutenant Navarro will. And a jury will. <laughs> a stripper and a... That's right, a stripper. A woman, a mother trying to do right by her child, and a wife trying to save her husband, both of whom you abused. Everyone will believe them, because everyone understands what they endured, what was at stake for them. Why you made them give in to you. And they'll admire their courage for speaking out. And they'll despise you. That's just because you're a bully and a degenerate and a rapist. Because you were a judge and you sat up there in those robes with those flags behind you and you did what? You perverted justice. You turned their best instincts against them so you could get off. And a slut. Pick. All right, back off, Nick. Stop that pig. Put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest. Get him out of here, Maddie. Just get him out of here so we can all breathe. <laughs> 